Now new at 6, another Northeast Ohio high school is in mourning. A Warrensville Heights junior has died after being in a fight with another teenage girl. And that girl is now in custody. News Channel 5's Stephanie Ramirez is working this story. And Stephanie, have we learned yet what caused this girl's death? Well, Lee, right now that is still under investigation, but police tell us or what we have learned from the Cuyahoga County Prosecutor's Office is that the other teenager involved has been charged with one count of murder and is now facing trial at a juvenile court. This all happened Wednesday at around 8 o'clock Wednesday night on Walford Road in Warrensville Heights. Police said two separate 911 calls were made that evening, one for a fight involving 16-year-old Shakira Dorsey and another for an ambulance. According to the police report, a witness said Dorsey had been punched repeatedly in the face during the fight. And afterwards, Dorsey's stepfather told police she started pacing back and forth and then collapsed. An ambulance rushed the 16 year old to a hospital where she later died. These are the 911 tapes. At the end of my driveway, it's some kids fighting, and it's adults there watching. It's adults, grown ups there watching them fight. She's on the bow, she's, she's breathing really hard. I, I, I can't explain it, ma'am. Shakira Dorsey was a junior at Warrensville High School. I'll have more from police and the community tonight at 11. Stephanie Ramirez, News Channel 5. A fight between two teenage girls ends with one of them dying not long after. And witnesses say the worst part is, had someone just stepped in, both girls would have two very different fates. Police say 16-year-old Warrensville Heights Jr. Shakira Dorsey died as a result of a Wednesday night beating. Channel 3's Pamela Osborne now joins us with more. Pamela, good evening. Good evening, Russ. Police have yet to identify the name of the other teen involved in this fight. Meanwhile, we spoke with a young woman today who said that these teens were fighting like nothing she'd ever seen before. And something else they were shocked to see, that adults were standing by watching this all happen, including the victim's stepfather. Shakira Dorsey, seen here smiling in a Twitter picture, was loved. The Warrensville Heights High School junior played on the Lady Tigers softball team. She passed away Wednesday night after witnesses say she took a brutal beating from another teen. According to police, Shakira confronted the girl in the parking lot of this apartment complex. The two began to fight. Shakira had stopped or whatever. The girl kept on fighting, hitting her. I seen Shakira fall to the ground. Catherine Owen says she saw Shakira fall here, and so did several other people, many of them adults, including Shakira's own stepfather, who reportedly allowed the teens to fight for some time before breaking things up. But for parents to sit there and watch a child be beat to death, that's tragic. No one knew it at the time, but those final steps Shakira took before she fell were likely her last. Owens can't help but wonder what would have happened if someone had stepped in sooner. How could you just sit there and watch these girls fight and you see the girl, like, you know, catching for, you know, and for her just to fall on the ground? That's sad. This mother, along with so many others, say their thoughts and prayers go out to the family. My condolences out to her mother because that that's a tragic thing. Kids get into different disagreements, but you don't expect your child not to come home. And Shakira was transported to the hospital where she died. Now the Cuyahoga County Medical Examiner is working to determine an exact cause of death as police continue to investigate here. Friends of Shakira, they're headed to Twitter expressing their sorrow and condolences for the family. And Russ, we're all told that there were grief counselors on hand to kind of talk to students and help get them through this very difficult time right now. Of course. Pamela Osborne, thank you.